Hey guys, I'm Zach Sykes with Homestead & Co. And today I wanted to answer the question around pre-foreclosures on Zillow. So one of the most asked questions we get as a real estate agent is, how do I buy this pre-foreclosure I found on Zillow? It looks like it's a great house and a great price. I wanna go save some money. So I'm gonna share my screen with you here, guys. And here I pulled up all of the foreclosures in Zillow. And you can see some of them are right here, like say pre-foreclosure. Some of them over here, I say foreclosure, okay? This one says pre-foreclosure as well. Guys, the difference here is you see foreclosure in the price, 149,000. On the pre-foreclosure, you see a foreclosure estimate of 161,000. Guys, there's a big difference there between the two. The foreclosures are actually for sale, ready to go. A pre-foreclosure is not actually a home for sale. The way Zillow finds these properties and identifies them as pre-foreclosures is through what we call a Liz Pendants. In order to be considered, or in order to have a lender put a Liz Pendants on, on title, a borrower or a homeowner is going to be in default on their mortgage, meaning they've missed a payment or two, maybe three. And that's the initial very first step in a short sale or foreclosure process. So what their existing lender is going to do is they're going to go to the county and record what they call a Liz Pendens on the title. And all that does is says, hey guys, there's a cloud on the title. You can't sell it without talking to us first. And because they're behind, late on stuff, they just wanna make sure that they're kept in the loop when and if the property sells. So a couple things could happen here. One, the homeowner could catch up and stay in the house and never ever sell the house. Option two, it may go all the way through foreclosure and they quit paying. And in that case, it may be a year, two years down the road before the house ever hits the market. And if it does, we have no idea what the price is gonna be until that time. It could be higher, it could be lower. Option three, they could eventually try to sell it to somebody else they know because they've got enough equity in it and it may still never hit the market. So guys, bottom line, if you're looking at a home today or home in the next couple of months, these pre-foreclosures really aren't for sale. What Zillow does is uses them as clickbait to keep you on their site. Guys, I'm Zach Sykes with Homestead & Co. And thanks for watching.